Hi Aquarians, a very happy new year to you. Uh, this video is for those of you who has uh, Aquarius moon sign or Aquarius zodiac sun sign or who has Aquarius ascendant in their charts. If you are not clear about what is moon sign and what is sun sign, there is a link in the description. Just click on that. It will take you to a short video, hardly 2-3 minutes, but it quickly explains to you what sun sign is and what moon sign is. So Aquarians, before I start, I'm going to, as always, I thank my spiritual gurus and I thank my Jyotish gurus for passing their divine knowledge to me. I'm truly grateful to have, have them teach me and receive knowledge from them. So the new year has not started really, really great for you. Uh, initially, you must have felt a little bit of turmoil and uh, 2018 also left you with a, a bit of turmoil. I can see that uh, for some of you, uh, you know, the new year has started on a note which has left you wondering that is this year going to be again like 2018. I think that 2018 would have been a year that for some of you got problems connected to work. You might have faced opposition at work. You might have faced uh, people who were manipulating against you. You might have faced, uh, you know, issues. Uh, with colleagues sometimes some of you might have faced issues with reputation where you were misunderstood or there was some name throwing around you so all that turmoil that you've been through you're going to leave it behind in this year and i promise you 2019 is going to be far more better so look into it and move forward with a positive thinking so january january uh, is going to be uh, you know starting at a slightly slow note where you're still wondering how the year is going to start but gradually things are going to get better i see that um i see a lot of you have opportunities uh, or occasions in which you have to abruptly uh, spend money so my advice would be take it a little easy plan your finances a little better so that you can save yourself from sudden large expenses so plan your finances a little carefully uh, I also see some amount of stress around, uh, you know, changes at work. So there could be a lot of changes happening at work. It will eventually lead to good stuff. But for now, you might be feeling a little stressed about things. So my advice would be get into some form of meditation. This is the right time to start meditating for you. There's also a link in the description where I've explained what is meditation. What is the fuss about? What is it exactly? Who should do it? what type of meditation you should do how do you select it it's not going to be very long it's going to be a couple of minutes 10 to 12 minutes but it will give you a lot of information that you can use wisely for yourself in the new year so please click on that video just hear that video out it will give you a, a new insight on what meditation is about and how it can bring in changes into your life now february is going to uh, continue to be a time when i would say focus on your health uh, Jan also I, I felt that it started with for some of you it started with you feeling really low on energy or you feeling that there could be health issues so I would say February focus on your health get into a regular healthy regime with uh, yoga or exercising try meditation so that your mental health is better if your mental health is good your physical health will be more energetic and you're going to feel better so try that out uh, I also see a lot of you planning new projects and getting into, uh, you know, in zone, uh, you're getting into the zone in February. Where suddenly work is growing. There's a lot to do. You need to organize your thoughts. So again, I would suggest get into chanting, get into meditation. It will help you with organizing your thoughts better. March is going to be uh, again bringing in a change. I see that uh, for some of you, uh, a lot of issues at work will start resolving. So a lot of people have been facing obstructions at work. You were feeling stuck around people you weren't happy working with. So now is the time whether they leave or you will move forward onto something else or just the issues will leave. So uh, it's March onwards you can see a zone where you're feeling better in terms of your work environment. You face less conflict at work. So it's be a positive change for you. My advice would be be very careful with communication in March. Don't put in too much uh, investments in the month of March. Plan your finances better so that you don't feel uh, harrowed about it and suddenly you realize that cash input is very less. So carefully in, uh, invest. March, avoid investments. 
either do it earlier jan and feb or then look at it later but march don't do in any fresh investments also uh, i would say that once again since i have seen that in 2018 a lot has been going on and this is going to be also a year with uh, which will bring you a lot of energy in terms of work and projects so please uh, look at a time for yourself to get into some form of meditation and chanting this is also a great time for you to make some social service you know where you can go and do some shramdan you can go to a gurdwara and help at the langar you can just do social service by feeding people people who are poor donating clothes to them in the cold weather or just doing some amount of you know basically creating positive karma around you so that this phase that you're coming out of starts even better for you and you uh, live through 2019 a more fulfilled life so primarily this is my predictions for the first quarter that is jan feb and march i will come back in april for the rest of the predictions i didn't want to put the entire year in one video because then it becomes really long and i also want you to see how you resonate with uh, these three months and then accordingly fit in you know the predictions for the rest of the year so uh, aquarians i wish you all the best things will get better and smoother for you in this year a very happy new year do get in more discipline in terms of your health and your mental health take care have a great day